actually going to play Yu-Gi-Oh! Legacy of the Duelist, as the screen says. But uh, I don't know if you guys know what Duel Links is. It's an app for the phone, Android, and um, Apple. There you go. That's the other one. <laughs> And uh, it's, it's Yu-Gi-Oh! Portable. I mean, it's it's awesome. Go check it out if you haven't checked it out. But so it it made me want to play Yu-Gi-Oh! And so today we're gonna play some uh, some Yu-Gi-Oh! So loading Yu-Gi-Oh! Histories. The story of Yu-Gi-Oh! Moto begins at Domino High School, where Duel Monsters, the hottest card game in the world, was all the rage. Yu-Gi-Oh! was the best duelist around, and his friend Joey de wanted desperately to learn how to duel as well. So our story of Yugi Moto starts with Yugi teaching the rules of Duel Monsters to Joey as their friends Tay and Tristan watch. Hey Joey, Eartha Joey, it's your turn. Um, aw, isn't he cute when he's thinking? Hey Tristan, Yugi here is teaching me how to play Duel Monsters. Drooling Monsters? Duel Monsters, you nimrod. They've been at it for hours, Joey. Starting, uh, starting to get the hang of the game, but Yugi's like an expert. Okay, Yugi, it's time to duel. Oh boy, I bet you we get a tutorial, which is gonna be great. Wow, what a stringing and draw. INFN8, sure can spin the t <laughs> What? Greetings, duelist. I am IN4M8, part of the virtual game simulator. I have been programmed to teach you proper dueling rules and the best practices. So let's get started and walk you through the basics. In this scenario, you will be taking on the role of legendary Yugi Moto, facing off against the not quite so legendary Joey Wheeler. Dude, Joey was one of my favorite characters. That's not even cool that they gotta do that to him. Just be like, nope, you're, you're crap. First, let's learn how to summon a monster. Monsters are summoned in the monster zone. Monsters can be summoned in attack position or set in the defense position. A monster in attack position is placed vertically in a monster. Defense position is placed horizontally. I don't think I can, like actually place the card. Let's set a monster. Okay. I'm gonna set this thing. 2,000 defense. Nothing's getting past it. And end the phase. End the phase. Let's go. Let's do it. Let's murder things. Oh, Joey's got some firepower. Ooh. Draw a phase. Main phase one. Congratulations. You survived your first attack. Well, that... You might have noticed that Joey's attack attack you and wound up hurting himself. Yeah, let me explain what happened. Oh, I already know what happened. The damage difference, is, that's how it works. Next time you play a spell card and trap card. These cards are placed in the spell and trap card. Though. Green spell cards can be played right away, but mostly can but most can be played in the main phase. One or two. You can also set it and activate it at a later time. Oh no, duh. Activate Banner of Courage right away. We'll set Call of Haunted. Because we dope. And then we will special summon. Oh, no, 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 no. We want to summon this dude. Summon. You, you really won't let me summon this? Or am I stupid? Send one monster. Okay. I want to summon it. But it's not letting me. Can I set this? No. Can I change you? Now let's summon. Oh, okay, it wants me to do specific thing. My bad. I didn't know. I didn't know. Our attack is all set up. Let's switch to the battle phase and attack. Oh, because Banner of Courage. Duh, I'm an idiot. Okay. Attack, attack, murder things. It's not gonna let me do what I want, but I have to do what it wants. Attack, murders, life points. End their turn. Well, what's Joey gonna do? Nothing. What a wimp. I was gonna tell me to do something specific again. Joey doesn't stand a chance. Let's clean the, clean the chalk. On this turn, I will summon. We will summon another monster. Up until now, you have only had monsters level four or below. In order to summon monster five, six, yes, okay. Only summon before because it wants to teach me how to summon it properly. I don't want to summon. Why would you summon Nintendo? Or why would you get rid of um 
I'm probably butchering his name. Nin Can Dog. Why would you? No, you always. Whatever. I'd rather get rid of the 1400 attack. But I suppose if you want to play strategically and have something for defensive in case he has a trap card, I don't fucking know, man. Bam. Uh, the card in the field has been destroyed. Activate the effect of the card. Ah, uh, do I? Do it? No. Actually, sure, why not? Let's steal something from his grave. Oh, okay. Never mind. It's thinking way ahead of me. I clicked it. Okay. What the fuck? Jesus, that took. <laughs> uh, it, was, it was glitching out for me, guys. Select the card to activate. Yeah, let's activate the board. No, he did a chain. Oh my god, it's a fucking chain. Ah. Now we're ready to attack. Are we? Are we though? I don't think we are. It's not. It's not possible. It's not happening. Ooh. I didn't think I was gonna win a tutorial. No. What a card that powerful totally wipes me out. Whoa, you stink at this game, Joey. You did fine, Joey. I just have better cards. My grandpa owns a shop, and gets all I get all my best cards from him. Your own grandpa's your own game shop? What are we waiting for? Let's go. Okay, maybe I'll even get my grandpa to show us a super red card he has. Little did they know that someone was listening on their conversation. Someone who was looking for a very rare card to add to their collection. Kaiba! Oh god, I got achievements. Uh, we get stuff. We get signature cards. And dual points. I would assume those are used to get packs. Cool. Let's do number two of the story. That afternoon, Yugi and his friends went to Grandpa's game shop. Yugi wanted to show his friends how to grab a... I'm done. I give up. I'm fucking... I'm done reading done. I can't read. I'm shit. Gramps, could you show my friends the awesome super rare card? Rare card? You mean my special card? Hmm. Please, please? How can I refuse? You kids are in for a treat. I don't take up this card too often. Oh, it's blue eyes. It's, it's the bluest of the eyes. Suddenly, a classmate from school ran into the shop. His name is Seto Kaiba, young CEO of Kaiba Corp, and he found the card he was looking for. Name your price for that blue eyes. I can pay anything you ask. I'm sure you could, but this card is worth more than you could ever offer. Sense of senile old fool. God, can't read. Don't make money. Kaiba stormed out in the Grandpa's store. Of the of Grandpa's store, the team was distributed by disturbed by Kaiba's obsession and the blue eyes white dragon. Next day, to skip Yugi and his friends rushed to Kaiba Corp and found Grandpa lying on the floor defeated. Grandpa, are you okay? Yuki had failed. I wanted to teach that boy Kaiba a lesson, but the heart of, but the heart of the cards, but I lost. Grandpa! How the old man How's the old man feeling, hmm? Kaiba, you sleaze, what have you done to him? Well, we had a duel, that's all. With each of us putting up our most valuable cards as a prize, but I guess playing against a champion like myself is just too much for this stimu too much stimulation for the whole pool. Kaiba, you should be ashamed of yourself. Look at the sweet prize I won. Kaiba held up Grandpa's blue eyes white dragon and ripped it in half. Grandpa's most treasured card! The blue eyes white dragon is a rare and powerful card, but this one will never be used against me. My blue eyes white dragon, my treasure! Oh, hold on. How could you do such a thing? Yugi, take this. Huh? Grandpa? I built this deck. I put my soul into these cards and taught him everything I know. Er, and I taught you everything I know. Take my cards and teach Kaiba to respect the heart of the card. Okay, Grandpa, I'll do it. Let's do it. Let's duel. Let's duel Kaiba. Let's duel. Story deck. Always use a story deck. Never, never use anything else. Mm, I am as solid as a rock. Get wrecked, Kaiba. I want to go second. I want to go second. I want to go second. 
Mm. Mm. Copy. Oh. Spell Bending Circle. Sword of Healing Light. Sodia. <laughs> Um, I don't want to use... You know what? Let's just do this. Let's do this. Let's see what happens. Uh, main phase one. Yeah, he's, he's terrified of my Celtic Guardian. Get three turns of free beast. Destroy the monsters your opponent controls. Uh, I mean, I mean, I'm I'm down for that. Let's go. Let's go. We're gonna win this without drawing Exodia, because I I just I want to murder Kaiba. Kaiba's gonna get wrecked. Kaiba's gonna get wrecked. Cut the guardian. Oh rip. Negate attack. And phase. I was a sleaze. That's not that's not very nice of Can we draw something like OP, please? I might have to just dark hole. I don't want to summon anything. We get one more turn of swords, so Swords of Revealing Light! Oh my god, it's the sword to stop everything! What the fuck is he doing? I'm scared. No, now we have a problem. Actually, no, I mean, I can dark hole, but I, I really don't want to. Rip. Well, we got the head, but I'm gonna have to dark hole. I don't have a choice. I don't want to be taking any damage. I suppose I could have waited. Never mind, that was dumb. I should have switched those two defense position, waited another turn, and then. Um, whatever, my bad. I made a mistake, but we're gonna attack him directly. Uh, main phase two, I should have played this right away. And we're gonna end our turn. Dude, you don't have something that can beat. No, I don't want it. With 1,000 or less attack, your opponent takes no damage until the end of your opponent takes no damage until the end of the next turn after this card is out. Also, you ruin your opponent's hand and all monsters they control. If they do, destroy the monster among them with 1,500 attack or more. That's pointless. Heart of the under underdog. Let's go! Heart of the Underdog, I'm pretty sure, just lets us draw an extra card each turn. Uh, at the beginning of our turn. Is music, though? No. We're not gonna activate Spellbinding Circle. Yes, we wanna draw another card. Snatch and steal? Ah, uh, no, no. Is it the draw phase? Activate the effect of the card? No. I don't want. I don't want to activate anything. No, I don't want to activate anything. Uh, I did forget what snatch and steal does. Equipped only to a monster your opponent controls. Take control of the equipped monster during each of your standby phases. Okay, they gain 1,000 life points. Oh, okay. Well, we better save that for when he summons something OP. Um, Battle phase. No, I'm not. I don't want to activate it. Jesus. Oh my God. No. Attack. 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 No. I don't want to activate effect. No, I do not. Just attack. Okay. Jesus. It's so clicky. No. God, never set Spellbinding Circle. It asks you way too many questions. Uh, no. 
now I'm gonna activate it actually. I don't wanna get wrecked. Yes, I wanna activate Heart of the Underdog. Ooh, we got Monster Reborn. Oh shit. Oh shit. I'm still monster from his grave. Oh, hells yeah. Hells yeah! Battle phase. Oh, I can't just click. Snatch and steal. Do I wanna? No, I, I spell binding circle. That, that's dumb. But let's let's go. Let's attack his axe raider, and then we'll end our turn. Oh man, Kaiba, you're getting wrecked. Not really. Poor Kaiba. Poor Kaiba. Graceful Charity. Oh my god. Do draw three cards, then discard two. Don't draw the two pieces of exotic. Okay. We're gonna do that, that, discard that. We almost got Exodia, guys. I don't know if I should go until we get Exodia or not, man. Uh, can I? I can't activate that on a, on a face down, I don't think. I do not think. That to be safe. Sweet. It gives me achievements every time I do something. That's cool. Maybe we'll draw Exodia this turn. That'd be dope. There better be a cutscene for it though. Yes, I want to activate Heart of the Underdog. Keep going. Um, do I want to waste my waste our time together, guys, and try and get Exodia? I feel like I have to. It's part of the story. I'm gonna wait until I get Exodia. I'm gonna wait until I get Exodia. Oh god. Oh god, we have a snatch and steal. Poor Kaiba. He doesn't know. We're gonna steal his blue eyes. Yes. Dude, Hardy the Underdog is broken in the Exodia deck. No, we don't want a dark hole. We just wanna activate snatch and steal and steal his blue eyes. Dude, there's no way we could have lost this. Oh, Blue Eyes gets a cutscene. Oh, that's amazing. I guess it could have could have been better, but oh well. Um, yeah, let's just. He's gonna be gaining a thousand life points each turn because I stole his Blue Eyes. Fuck the dark hole. We don't need it. Good. We are good. Yes, activate Heart of the Underdog. Always. Let's get Exodia. Come on, keep drawing. Normal monsters. Keep the normal monsters coming. Come on, come on. Uh, are you kidding me? Are you fluffy kidding me? Set. I'm not gonna attack, guys. I want to summon Exodia. There's only 14 cards left. We don't draw Exodia, we're summoning Dark Magician. We got Pot of Greed. Okay. Uh, I th we pretty much got the win. No matter what. Well, we've had it for a while, but still. Achievement Sacrifice! Woo! I sacrificed monsters. I did it. I did it. Pot of Greed. Give me Exodia. Oh, are you kidding me? Dude, three Swords of Revealing Light. It's broken. Huh. Oh, Dark Magician gets a cutscene too. Oh shit. 
He didn't even do anything, he just like die. And they all died. It's fucking awesome. Let's see. Did we get a cut no. Aw. Remember the cutscene. That's depressing. What the crap, man? Discard from my hand. Okay, I'll discard this thing. Ten cards. If we don't draw Exodia pretty soon, I'm gonna be upset. Dude, Yugi's just got a skull deck right now. Fucking Karibo, man. I'm just gonna end. I wanna. I wanna draw Exodia. There's gotta be a cutscene for Exodia. If there's not, that's bullshit. And I'm gonna be pissed. A second Heart of the Underdog? You kidding me? Let's do it. Let's do it. I don't know if I can draw like three cards now per turn or what, or if I can keep drawing. Like after this one's done, then I draw another card. That'd be broken. Oh man. I fucked up, guys. Maybe not. Now Exodia is our only help. Do we get to draw two cards? We do! And there's no cutscene. That's stupid. You won by the effects of Zodia the Forbidden One. You play only for power, Kyla. That's why you lost. But if you put your heart in the game, there's nothing you can't do. That That's a life quote. Use it for life. It's good for everything. The result of the duel qu spread quickly. And the mysterious one-eyed man got news of Yugi's victory. Pegasus. Hmm, it seems Kaiba Boy has been defeated in a duel. I must learn more about Yugi Moto. Oh, snap. We're unlocking shit from the duelist. We can duel as Kaiba. Yeah. Yeah. What? Card awards, DP. Cool, man. Cool. I like it. Well... I think that'll be good for this episode, guys. Uh, if you enjoyed, leave a like, comment, subscribe. Uh, we'll take on, it looks like Weevil, uh, next next time. So if you want to see more, just let me know. I'll be here playing the duels of the Yu-Gi-Oh's. Have a great day. Goodbye!